How you going? It's Pirate Girl. Welcome to my new home. We've got ourselves a proper two bedroom house. Not that I can afford it, but we live in New Zealand, so they help us with those sorts of things here. The good old USA. But after 12 years of hardcore single-handed parenting, Lady Rebecca has come to me. So now I'm painting her purple. It's really a metaphor for getting back to myself. When I had my purple boat, I just went about the world with so much confidence and competence. And I don't know, swagger. So let's get right into it today. We've got a big job ahead of us. We're gonna paint my boat. Paint that bitch purple. Who knows, maybe I'm gonna get my mojo back. Big job. Good morning, sunshine. Here we go again. It's happening. So I found a place that can mix my purple and I'm trying to figure out the perfect color. Uh, what do you reckon? Purple silk, purple crossing, and then all of these pretty purples. So this transformation is well underway already. Since I've gotten this boat out of the water, the difference for me in my life, it's been actually pretty amazing. I feel stronger, I feel more motivated, I feel more focused, but today's the day we're really gonna see a difference. Transformation, bring it on. Actually, the first time I took my boat out of the water, I painted her white with a little red stripe along the bottom. It wasn't until she sank. When I bought her, this couple had owned her for like, I don't know, 20 years. There were charts from San Francisco all the way up to Alaska and then down through the Panama Canal, all over South America and the Caribbean. You know, and she had all of their stuff. It didn't quite feel like my boat until after she sank and I rebuilt her. And at that point, I was like, fuck it. I can paint her any color I want to. it to be very clear that even if there was a man on board she was my boat because you'd be surprised how many times <laughs> I'd have a guy sailing with me and people would address him like he was the captain uh-uh honey uh-uh she's mine so yeah when I painted her purple that was really me claiming her She's mine. She belongs to me, and I belong to myself. Thank you very much. Here we go, sanding. I hate sanding, but it's just one of those things that need to be done. Really bad, you don't have to bark at everyone. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff like that in life, isn't there? Shout out to Kai, my number one fan. Yeah, pirate girl. Painting it purple is about following your dreams. 
Painting it purple is about you doing you, loving yourself exactly how you are. Painting it purple is about saying, fuck it, I'm gonna be me. Painting it purple is about healing yourself and giving your gifts to the world because the world needs your gifts. Purple is a spiritual color. It represents bringing oneness out of the contrast, the feminine and the masculine. It's a color of power. Paint that bitch purple. And then you stir the paint. And then you stir the paint. And Sniffing in the paint fumes. Here we go. It's amazing how much that makes me happy. I love it! It's the same color as my boat before! It just like fills me with all those feelings of my purple boat back in the day. What's the feminine equivalent of cocky? Paint it purple. Follow your dreams. Trust in spirit. Develop your gifts. <laughs> Love yourself. Heal yourself. <laughs>